Justin Bress. I hope you're doing well out there today. Um, just doing a video on a very special instrument, um, special to me in particular, because this is the very first trumpet that I had built for me when I started getting into learning how to make trumpets. Um, for those of you who do not know, um, I recently founded the Kansas City Trumpet Company and in the process of making horns um, that are going to be exclusively sold through Austin Custom Brass. And uh, before I started that, I had this horn made for me using all parts that I wanted to use from different makers and things like that. Um, so it was kind of my venture into the custom trumpet world, if you will. Um, this one is made on a Meinl Schmidt valve block, um, which is the Maw valves. As you can see here, they have that cut out um, to make the horn a lot more open, um, almost like a rotary valve, but without losing that piston power, you know? Um, so this valve block is also used by a lot of other high-end makers, um, and I will be using this block on some of my instruments as well. Um, uh, Lotus uses them, uh, Air Residence, uh, Martin Bem, and some other, you know, Makers Eclipse, uh, I know uses some of them as well. Um, the bell itself is from Lotus. Um, this is their silver flare bell. So it's a yellow brass stem um, underneath the purple lacquer, of course, and we'll get to that later. <laughs> um, with a sterling silver flare on the end, and check out that bead on the bell as well. It's super flat. I'm not even sure there's a wire in there at all. Um, there might be, I don't know. Um, it's also pretty dead. Uh, and this bell is made for Lotus by Andy Taylor in the UK. Um, a super, super awesome bell. I really like it. It's a very wide. It gives you a nice big sound. Um, but if you want to push it, you can. And I think what really helps is that, that sirling on the end. It's also a fairly, you know, compact taper until it gets to the end here. Um, the buttons, synthetic opal. These were made by Yuan DeWitt in, uh, in Canada. He's awesome. Go check out his, his horns as well if you get the chance. Um, and then most of the rest of the horn is either Air Resonance or Adams. Um, Air Resonance did the um, buttons, uh, I shouldn't say not the inlays, but the buttons themselves are bronze. Uh, the valve stems are bronze, the caps are bronze, the bottoms are bronze. Even the model water keys are also made of bronze. Um, and then the tuning slide is nickel silver by Adams. The lead pipe is an A1V2 uh, lead pipe from Adams and the receiver as well. Um, the front brace here, is an OEM Colicchio Z-Brace, which is really cool as well. Um, and you can see there's some lacquer wear. As uh, colored lacquer tends not to hold up as well as your standard lacquer. Um, and there were, you put like several coats on here. Um, by the way, it was done by Heritage Music Repair here in Kansas City. They do really good lacquer work if you're looking for someone to do that. Um, and uh, yeah, so I'm eating through it like fairly quickly, um, but um, if you're looking to purchase this horn, we can always strip it for an additional like few bucks, um, not, not too much, and um, we're happy to do that for you. Um, but yeah, this is a super horn. It's been, I've uh, been using it for about two years um, in my everyday playing, and uh, I just need to sell it to fund uh, my business, so I'm reluctant to see it go. Like, I was literally playing on it before recording this video. And I was like, man, should I really sell this? <laughs> but I kind of need to. Uh, I'm really sad, uh, but it does need to, to go to a, a good home. Um, so yeah, I'm selling basically my entire trumpet collection uh, to to support what I'm doing now and at the Kansas City Trumpet Company. So stay tuned for that. But uh, yeah, uh, it's a really, really great instrument. Um, free blowing, um, but it has a real nice compactness in the lead pipe here. So. It's very easy um, to play. It doesn't require a whole bunch of air or something like that. Um, yeah, it's just a really, really awesome instrument. And uh, whoever gets it is gonna be super happy. Um, so let me play a bit more on this horn for you guys.
response is very fast. Uh, it has that real nice full sound to it, and you get a little bit of zing on that sterling. It's just a really, really awesome trumpet. Uh, so whoever gets this is going to be super excited. Um, but I just wanted to make this video to let you know how it sounds and uh, a little bit of the backstory behind why it exists. And uh, yeah, super, super awesome horn. Um, again, sad to be selling it, but you know, you got to get money to start the business. So uh, again, thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, you can just call us, send us an email, smoke signal, you know, something like that. Um, and we're happy to help out if you have any questions in particular about this instrument as well. Um, hit that subscribe button. Be sure to like the video. You can stay up to date um, with all of our YouTube comings and goings. So thank you again for watching and I hope you guys all have an awesome day.